Hello there, lost one. This is Sachi So back at it again. It's been a while since I did something like this. Welcome to Siren Head Awakening. Let's get into the October mood. I'm gonna be uh put a pause. I was going back to regular gameplay for the duration duration of October mostly. I might do like a one shot roleplay here and there based on horror. Maybe it depends. But I'm gonna play a lot of horror games this month. You know, for that October feeling. Even though Death Room is extremely popular during this time, uh, I might do a Death Room recording. Even though I kind of know mostly what's gonna happen. But let's say that for just a second. Welcome to Siren Head Awakening! Woo! It's been a while since I got excited to play a game. I never played any of the Siren Head games, actually. I know everything about Siren Head, and I've seen gameplay of the of two of the games in the past. I think this might be a little loud. I'm gonna have to do this max brightness, even though it'll be better with lower brightness uh, due to. Okay, I'm gonna have to cut this down some. Oh, I wanted this music to copyright it. <laughs> To Siren Head Awakening. Uh, there was an alert that I didn't record before, so I'm gonna say this right now. If you have anything with like problems like flashing lights or loud noises or certain colors, uh, please do not continue off at this point because this, at least I think, will be very great. Oh, permitted by Trevor Henderson. Uh, that's that we got the stuff there. Let's see. Ah. Shoot. Normal? <laughs> I'm gonna regret this. I didn't watch that play a proper game. I probably should put the baby. <laughs> I'm not that good at games. Well, at least I'm not that good at survival games. Well, here we go. Earth is dark and dawn is bold. We stare into the abyss and we see Siren Head staring back at us. Siren Head Awakening. Let's skip nothing, but I don't want to skip. We need that sweet, sweet lore. Friday, March 21, 1997. Welcome to Siren Head Awakening. You find yourself in the middle of the dark forest with nothing but a flashlight. You must find four car parts scattered across the map to repair your broken car and escape. Due to physical limitations, you can only hold one car part at a time. Finding this car part among other items also seems to be angering the beast lurking in the shadow. Siren Head. You get a gas pan, gas oil, spark plug, and battery. Stamina is an important part of your life when sprinting through the woods. You are very vulnerable. Without it, use it wisely. Your flashlight is also a valuable tool. It makes sure to turn off when you hear siren hitting nearby or else you get hunted. When being a hunter, it's a good idea to try and find shelter while running away. Siren hand cannot reach for you when you're inside a building or vehicle. Use what you learn to try and escape. Good luck. Oh. Don't have any parts. Oh, oh, ooh. It is options. Control. Okay, that's way better. I thought. 
It didn't tell me how to turn off the light. Oh crap. Um was like the jump. Oh flash light is L. E to you. I don't like know that from outside in real life or his iron head. This game, I'll be very bad at this game. I'm only gonna record for a little bit uh, before I stop the recording. And I guess if y'all want to, I will continue it on until I complete it. I don't know if this is all there is to the game or not, or if there's like more to the story. Uh, you can let me know in the comment section below. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. Actually, no, I might need to go this way. This road, path road. I should be okay until I get the first item, though. All that graphics in the back, with the, the moving graphics for lo loading that, almost made me thought there's something walking ahead of me. I'm like, oh. I'm not someone to get easily scared. Well, let's. Ugh, this bus. It looked like a deep. Oh. Let me go ahead and close this door to read this note. Actually, I might play this fully. Just not all in one thing. I hope that doesn't count as item when Siren Head's coming. I'm lost and scared. I can't find where the others are. They say they're going to check out some places for shelter. I stay and put in the rest of the bus. I heard a monster horrifying sounds from the distance. Towards my friend's direction. I can't help but feel that death is coming. I must find my friends and get the hell out of here. I mean, no brainer, they probably most likely did not survive. Whoa! Y'all seen that, right? The, the siren head. Can I come out? So, that page does count as an item. I'm reluctant to go out. No sounds. I can't tell if it's Siren Head or it's real life. <laughs> oh. This road. Can I go up? No, this is a train track. I won't make this video overly long because I want to do some other recordings today. I say so far it seems like a very short game. I've already do interval of it four mats. Every time I get an item and make it back. I just realized something. How do I get back to the car? Siren Head's walking off. Oh. You're diddly daddling. I don't have no Girl Scout cookies. Go away. Why can I? Okay, I need to turn this 
flashlight in order to pick stuff up? Actually, let me look around and see some lore. I can't tell what that is. It must be remember, above every lore. Alaban. Na. Alabella. Na. Alabella. What? I don't understand that word. Ooh, that ominous. Bowman footsteps coming closer and closer. His barren, blaring silence had to deafen and surround the environment, making your legs weak. You feel a lift from the ground, your body frees in fear. Closing the time, your escape was cut short. The sight of Siren Head make you tremble to the core. You realize, in the midst of the chaos, you're going to die. You are dead! <laughs> Be careful when trading. Getting too close to Siren Head will get you killed. It goes all the way back to the menu. Ooh. Well, I got the first item. I'm going to try to, uh, before the next recording, go ahead and put that battery in. Then start it with me going after the next one. Because I don't know how long this game is. I'm going to put it into short intervals. I need to do other recordings today as well. So that should be it for Siren Head Awakening for this time. It's good see through like how this game mechanics is like i'm not gonna play it full off on the next pack i might complete it on the next video and make it a bit longer and just do like court cuts and stuff of me while i complete this maybe but that should be it for this one that's good reminder to show you the the game and how it works and functions and also have me see how it works and function i probably need some practice with this but uh, that should be it for this recording, Lost Ones. And uh, I guess after this, I'll be recording some more videos. I don't know if I'm going to repost them all at the same time or just poking up on recordings to place throughout the week. But look forward to a Halloween mashup. I'll try. There's no promises, but I'll try to have enough recordings where I can merit to at least upload. Uh, every day for October. So by the time I get to my next off day, I can do a couple recordings that time and upload and have it to be able to be uploaded every day. Maybe in the comment section stuff, seeing videos. Uh, but remember, even though the video coming out like day after day, I am still all record. I'm recording all this stuff on the same day, so I'm all unable to see your comments to be able to react to whatever future video through that week. I will still look through the comments for my next recording session, but for the videos through the week, it most likely will not affect, maybe. I don't know. It depends on how many recordings I'm doing uh, today. But at least I spent a couple recordings every week uh, from now on for October for Folk Fest, which is my favorite time of year. Anyway, last one. See you on the next episode. And also, thank you all for over 640 subscribers. This would be so much to me. I don't expect there to be too much subscribers when I first started because I was stuck at 17 for a long time. That boosted up to 500 or something. I was extremely ecstatic. I was planning on doing a special, but ended up getting like, delayed with other projects. And then, just a couple days ago, we made it over 600. Definitely gonna do a special. I don't know what to do specifically for a special. I might do a short video uh, thanking everyone, and maybe I do something else on the side, maybe an art video while I'm doing it. Maybe I'm not entirely sure. Maybe a music video, or maybe just a sort of gameplay or whatever. I don't know. But uh, 
and away. I'll see you all in the next video. Make the best take home as I shall stare back.